Police were justified in a deadly officer-involved shooting. A detective shot and killed 17-year-old Jorge Miguel Lopez following a car chase on November 8th. News Channel 12 star Connor was there today to hear the DA's findings. She joins us now live. District Attorney Ernie Lee says that the shooting didn't have to happen the way it did, but he's ruling in favor of the detective who shot Lopez dead. He says that detective saved the lives of the officers on the scene. The shooting death of Lopez is found to be justified to protect the safety and lives of the law enforcement officers from potential harm. Those were the words era. District Attorney Ernie Lee laid out in a press conference Wednesday after an officer involved shooting left 17 year old Jorge Miguel Lopez dead. Lee says the events on November 8th started when Lopez and three other people inside of a Chevrolet Malibu led officers on a high speed chase throughout Jacksonville. The car eventually ended up in a ditch where the other suspects in the car ran away, leaving Lopez alone. In the report, Lee says Lopez pointed a gun at the detective and that's when that detective shot at Lopez four times. There is no evidence that the number of shots fired by the detective was excessive. Lee says the shooting was self-defense. Lopez never fired his weapon. In fact, his weapon was, weapon was not loaded. But of course, the officer would not know that when the officer, when the, uh, Lopez displayed the weapon and pointed it at the officer. Pointing a firearm at someone would be apparent danger. From the evidence, it reasonably appeared to the detective was sufficient evidence for self-defense and defense of others. Federal courts in this nation have held the United States Constitution simply does not require police to gamble with their lives in the face of a serious threat of harm. As for the remaining three suspects, the driver of the car was arrested and charged with a number of drug and motor vehicle offenses. The passenger in the back of the car was arrested and charged with the drug and other offenses. No juvenile petitions have been filed for the 17 year old in the rear passenger side seat. Now, right now, that detective that was involved in that shooting is working on desk duty for until further notice. He, along with the other officers at the scene, will face no criminal charges. In Onslow County, I'm Star Connor for News Channel 12.